Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. Here is Ms. Faranjum, Biology Lecture. I welcome you all. This is week 1, day 4. I am going to deliver lecture number 4 in which I am going to discuss about your assignment and then I am going to discuss about the practical. Welcome to APSEX online support program. Here is chapter number 6, Enzymes. We are going to discuss the exercise question from understanding concept. Here is question number 1. That how would you define enzyme? Also describe their characteristics. You have to answer this question. Question number 2 is what do you mean by activation energy? Activation energy is it is the minimum amount of energy required to start a biochemical reaction. And the next is, why is it referred in the definition of enzyme? You have to answer this question on your NEET registers. Okay, the next question, question number three is, define cofactor and coenzyme. As you know that, here you are seeing that cofactor is a known protein part of enzyme and coenzyme is the part of or is the type of cofactor which is loosely attached with the enzyme and detached when the reaction is completed. Now move toward the practical. practical. Now move toward the practical. Practical number one. Review of class eighth practical. Here we are going to discuss about the practicals which we have learned in class eighth. Here is the diagram of light microscope. You have to draw this microscope on your practical note copies also mention the labelings here you can see the ocular lens body tube resolving known species objectives arm stage course adjustment adjustment knob fine adjustment knob base light source diaphragm and stage clips the next practical is the diagrams of unicellular organisms unicellular organisms are those which are living entities that have only one cell. And you can see these microorganisms under microscope. Here you can here you can see the species, microorganism species. Number first mentioned here is amoeba. Here you can see the diagram in which nucleus is present. Two vacuole are present, food vacuole and contractile vacuole and pseudopodium, a false food. The second one diagram is paramecium. In paramecium, there is also present two vacuoles, food vacuole and contractile vacuole, a nucleus, micronucleus and macronucleus and a small hair-like extensions uh, on its outer surface that is cilia. The third one diagram is of euglena. In euglena, you can also see a, a central nucleus, a pigment spot and chloroplast and a long thread-like structure called flagellum. Now come toward the next question that is identify organ and organ system in dissected frog. Here is the diagram of dissected frog in which you can see the organ and organ system of frog. Number first is larynx, then heart, Pair of lungs, right lung and left lung. Inside it, there is a present stomach. Then, pair of ovaries, bladder and rectum. In this slide, you have to determine the effect of tonicity on plasmolysis in plant cell and on red blood cell. Here you can see the diagram of animal cell in which red blood cell is presented and the next one is plant cell and you can see three conditions that is hypotonic, isotonic and hypertonic condition. Dear students, you should have to draw these mentioned diagrams on your practical notebook. Thank you.